Well, look, yeah, I mean, I, uh, you know, back in January, um, I endorsed him. I think it's really important that we win this election, and, and I reiterated uh, that to him. Uh, you know, we're going to be uh, active in a variety of capacities uh, throughout the rest of the year for to help, uh, you know, not just the top of the ticket, but but all around the, the country and particularly in Florida with some of the key issues we have to deal with. Uh, but, you know, a lot of it was just uh, connecting about things. I mean, look, he's a dad. He's got a kid going to, to college. You know, I'm a dad. I've got three young kids in the household. Uh, he's concerned about how my wife was doing. Obviously, she she had a, a cancer scare a couple years ago. Uh, so it was just a, a good meeting and a good conversation. But um, he understands the importance of this election. He understands the, the damage that Biden is doing. And I think you would see 180-degree uh, different policies uh, if we're able to win in, in November, which is important that we do. DeSantis is class. He is a million percent class. And by the way, I can't think of a better way to bum out the left going into the summer than, you know, that meme of DeSantis and Trump and like two dudes shaking hands, like coming together. That's so that's something that's gonna make it's gonna make the left really depressed. Welcome back to the program, Dana Lash with you. Top of the second hour. We told you that they uh, met on Sunday talking about fundraising and DeSantis is because, you know, 2024, November, not that long away, y'all. We're getting into it now. We're in it now. I know that like the election season seemed long, but that's just because the primary started so early. But we are in it now. And um, I just think he's pure class. And I got to say, I like it. You know, people get into squabbles and all of that stuff during politics. The people who are true pros. And the people who are emotionally mature enough to handle it are those who don't take it personally and remember, you know, who their actual allies and their friends are and those who don't. And the ones who don't, those are the trash people that you just discard by the wayside. So this is class. It's like a Republican Voltron coming together. I have said this for so long, isn't it? Right? Form the, the arms and legs and I'll form the head. And then, like, uh, my favorite part of the Voltron is I had, gosh, I loved that show when I was a kid. And I had, like, the smaller Voltron and I had the bigger Voltron because all my cousins got me one of the cats one year. I Each cousin got me a cat. And I had the whole thing. And you remember Voltron would be up in the air and then his feet would, wow, wow. And then his hands would, wow, wow. Because they were the cats. Right? Was it a lion roar? I never understood it, but they did. I Actually, I don't care. It's just, it's Voltron. That's all you need to know. It's amazing. And oh man, gosh, that was whenever Voltron came together. Seriously, think about it. You guys know, I still get chills. I get chills thinking about it now. Any episode, he's getting ready to fight the boss. And, you know, because Voltron collectively all together is a he. It's just this. And when they all come to, I mean, everybody, they all bring their specific skill sets and they all come together. To make Voltron. They're powerful in their own right, individually. But they're unstoppable when they're all together. And they, and oh man, you knew when, when Voltron, all the cats were coming together, somebody was getting a whooping and you could not wait. And it's that anticipate, I get, gosh dang, I got chills right now thinking about it. It's so inspiring. I loved it. Oh my word. And they come together and I love, by the way, how all the bad guys stop fighting with Voltron and the cats long enough for Voltron to form. And to monologue about it the whole time, thank right? God. Yeah, thank, thank God. heavens. Like you know, that that the I, I loved it. Full that was time my second defender. anime as a kid. You know, what my first anime was what? Speed Racer. Oh, that's all right. But as I mean, growing up in the United States in the seventies and into the eighties, that's literally the only anime we ever had was Voltron and Speed Racer. I never just I never thought about it. Voltron is actually anime, yeah. huh? I mean, it's true. Yeah. Fascinating. Look at that. I just, but that was, <sighs> activate interlocks. I don't even know what that is, but I remember it, right? Dynatherm's connected. What is that even? I don't know, but it means somebody's getting whooped. That's what it means. Infracell's up. What? Don't even know, but someone's going to get their ass beat. The mega thrusters are a go. Mega thrusting to whoop you down. That's what it is. Oh, my gosh. Man alive. That's some inspiring stuff this Friday, is it not? How, how old are the people that don't know about Voltron? You know about Voltron, don't you, Steve? 
What? Wait you're a minute. in your late 20s. Stop the show. You're in your late 20s. Stop the Juan, show. Juan is shaking his head, too. He doesn't have a clue. Like, wait, he's disappointed that Steve doesn't know or Juan doesn't no, have a clue? No, that Juan also doesn't know and has never heard of Ultron. Well, oh. Wait a minute. I know it's Friday, guys. Bear with me. Hold up, because this has has wait actually we... influenced me to a egregious degree, Voltron, as a child. Holy cow, we're that old. Or they are just that un-American. <laughs> I am shocked. I know it's anime. Shut I, up. Doesn't at matter. what age did you guys watch, watch? Like, for example, at what age were you watching that show? I was in elementary Your school. Age. I don't know. No, so what, eight, seven, eight? It would have been yeah. in the 80s, so I would have been, uh, like, early teens. Yeah, I was okay, like I'll seven, say ten. Eight years old. I was ten in two thousand five. So you you put that together. Well, I mean, still, I mean, there's reruns of Voltron was running. Steve could be my accident brother. <laughs> so Voltron, because you guys don't, I can't believe we're, we're having to. Oh my gosh, I I bet everybody in the chat's dying right now, right? Because right? everybody knows, everybody knows uh, Voltron. My kids know Voltron. Well, it's because I'm their parent. Um. They probably but not. Your kids know Voltron, Kane. Uh, yeah, they absolutely know Voltron. Yeah. They know they were first introduced to all the animes. When they started showing me animes, then I'm like, well, you want to see some OG animes? Here we go. And then you blew their and minds. And then I blew their minds. I, that's my favorite. Like, yeah, I take it and raise you a Voltron. And then they're like, what? Larry, our listener, said he was 42 in 2005, and he didn't know about Voltron. What? Larry? We're going to, Larry and Steve and Juan are going to have to go to Voltron school man. and everyone else out there. Oh man. Wasn't this, this, so first off you, you have, you have the team of f- five and they all shut up one. <laughs> the they, body, the arms, the legs, and the Yeah. Head. They all had a cat and then they all came together to form Voltron right. and Voltron protects the, uh, universe. The, uh, yeah. But a specific planet. And then there's uh, uh, King Zarkon, and he fights, and they got, you know, all the... Body. And uh, wasn't there... Wasn't it from... Uh, wasn't Voltron from Go Lion? Was it? I think so. Was it? I don't know. See, this is I where me being di- separated at the time thing. kicks in. I think that was a different thing. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. Anyway. But, um, yeah, it was... And they would fight, and they they had... Uh, they, they I mean, it, gosh, I, can we... We can't play the theme, or we'll get totally... Kicked with a copyright, won't we? Will we? I think so. If, if you give it to me, it. I can play it. If Steve plays Steve it. Steve can play it. Steve, I'm going to need the Voltron theme. It's Friday because, guys, you, you need to understand America. I know it's Japanese. Shush up. This is what I'm talking about. Everybody coming together for the good of the country. It's the Voltron politics strategy. I've been talking about this for like a decade. I've been saying this forever. People are now repeating it. It is the Voltron strategy for winning elections. Everyone brings their skill set. On the simulcast, they're not getting it, but we're playing it right now. The How Legend did we get Voltron, here? Defender of the universe. Doesn't matter. We're here now. Loved by good. Feared by evil. So great. This is good audio. Yeah. Oh, it's amazing audio. This dude's voice. I, I wanted to leave my voicemail grading. His voice reminds me of Captain Crunch. I bet he is. He's probably dresses like uh, Burt Reynolds. He sounds like it. I just want to hear them form the cat. Form the all the cats come together and form Voltron. Here it goes. The five pilots. It's like better than Transformers. It is. I said. It. Okay, golly, this is like way earlier. I know, like, we have to apologize to the TV audience. The TV people have no idea what's going on. They're like, why is she <laughs> just talking? We're playing the Voltron theme that we can't play on yeah. the simulcast because we'll get our asses Can one even show what Voltron looks like on the screen? Yeah, we can't. Can't even we'll get, show that? We'll get, we'll get dinged for a copyright what? violation. But just get to where they're like, they form it because that's the part where all oh. the kids, I would stand up in my living room watching this and I'm like, yes! If you didn't do that, I literally would raise my arms and feet up. And didn't they like create a sword uh, out of nothing? Yeah, like, yeah. The uh, Blazing Sword. Yeah, the Blazing Sword. Yeah, yeah, sword. yeah. Oh, my gosh. It was amazing. And it was... Like, he literally formed it out of the ether. Boom. Talking so, about one saying there's Voltron indoctrination going on right now. Yeah, just get me to where they formed the Voltron, Steve. Just get me there. 
Just get me there because that's what Trump and DeSantis are doing right now. Well, people I'm can tell it's it. Friday. And yeah, they can tell it's Friday. And also, I'm really trying to drive this point home because I see people who are like the, I see the, 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 some of the hardcore. And I look, I like DeSantis in the primary. You guys know that. I will literally steamroll your grandmother over to win. I'm not even joking. If I, if they're like, Danny, you got to roll over this old lady to win in, in November. Okay. Oh, I got, I got, I got, I got, I got, Danny I got, care. I got, I got. Go got. play it, play it. Right. Oh, yes. There it is. I don't know what the hell an interlock. Dinotherms. Mega thrusters. Gosh. Still, the chills. TV audience is just watching you do like mime. They have no idea. It's the Voltron <laughs> thing. We can't play it on things. simulcast. We'll get sued. They're forming it right now. It's so flipping amazing. Oh my gosh. I had every one of these. And see, now they're all coming together coming and together. he's going to narrate. Like you would in any is. respectable anime. Form feet, feet and, and legs. legs. The cat's coming together. Arms and. There you go. Arms and body. And here it comes. And it's forming right now. Head. Like the head. Right. And then he's like, the cats are growling. His hands are growling. His feet are growling. And then he does the blazing sword. And oh my gosh. I want to find out who's watching this. And not hearing the Voltron theme. They're not hearing the Voltron theme. And, and how, they're like, what is the matter with her? How they feel about these last few She's minutes. She's on drugs. She's on drugs. Do you know that because we can't play certain things on the television simulcast, people watch it and they're like, is she high? I'm not even kidding. Like, that happens. Oh, man. Yeah, Voltron was the best. 